Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Quick Scopes. Today we have the Air Vapor Max Evo. Before anything, I'd like to say a big shout out to Nike for sending me these. Very, very much appreciated. Thank you. Let's take a look at this box though. Hands down, this is the best box of 2021. Easy. Look at that. Let me take this opportunity to ask you to like, leave your thoughts, subscribe, ring that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Ah oh yeah, purchase link for Nike members only. So make sure you're logged in. Stay tuned for the on foot. Hey, got some literature. Not gonna show you everything, but very, very nice. Also, some information on the box. Nice. So yeah, let's start from the soles up. So we have a Vapormax outsole. Look at that. We've got the um, we've got the air units right there. We've got the um, pods. We've got black sitting on white rubber and obviously those translucent pods and we've got that gray towards the heel. Very, very nice. The midsole, as we know, it is a Vapormax midsole and we've got elements of previous um, Air Maxes, um, most notable this Air Max Plus section here. Very, very nice. We've got a white midsole with black, hints of that translucent grey and then black towards the heel very very cool and for the upper so this shoe is a blend of seven different air maxes and we've got different elements of each of those on this upper so for example we've got the mud guard from the air max 90 here we've got portions here from the air max 9096 and also elements up here from the 1999 model. Very, very cool. We've got that lever around the toe with reflective elements as well. We've got mesh on the toe box, which is pretty cool. And we've got the Nike little B swoosh, mini swoosh as well. Going up the shoe, we have the anthracite colored laces. Um, also got that anthracite tongue, that tongue Featured on the Air Max 93 and we've got some Nike branding as well. I really like the font of the Vapor Max because it showcases different elements of um, Nike Air Max branding and I really like the different letters especially the V on the Vapor Max which is an A but it's upside down I really like that. Going up the upper we have the, the swoosh and that is from the Air Max 180 Plus 3, but it's also quite resemblant to the Air Max BW, as you can see, the white on the grey, and it just extends around to the heel. And with the heel, we've got a multitude of different Air Max Nike branding. As you can see, we've got that Vapor Max again on the pool tab, and we've got this portion here, which is from the Air Max 93. Very, very nice. I think the most subtle part of detail is the five dots from the Alpha series. The sock liner is a dark gray and the insole features the Nike Air Vapor Max branding with um, those different fonts again and obviously it's a mashup, as I said, of seven different Air Maxes. What I like about this, it's a link to the past, but this insult is a link to the future um, with sustainability in mind as it's a regrind material insult. Very, very nice. Let me know what you think of this pair. Stay tuned for the on foot as well. Also, if you pick up a pair, make sure you use the hashtag members spotlight. You can see it right here. 
um, so you have the chance to feature on the Nike app. Remember, if you want to purchase a pair, ensure that you are logged in because it's members only for the moment. It's an exclusive. So yeah. So yeah. Big shout out again to Nike for sending me these. I've been Scopes. Stay tuned for the on foot. See ya!